What's going on guys, Armod here. Season 3 is finally here and with it came a ton of insane new changes. Today we're going to be taking a look at every single change that Epic made. Before we continue, make sure to drop a like and subscribe and I hope you guys enjoy. Alright guys, today we're going to be taking a look at every single change that Epic made in the brand new Season 3 update. Alright, so the first couple of weapon changes, uh, Epic Games did remove most of the weapons that were introduced last season, like the drum shotgun, the thermal AR, all those guns. Here we have one of the brand new guns, the hammer assault rifle. It's kind of like a suppressed scar, I'm not exactly sure how good it is. The stats are on the screen right now. It's good for medium to short range encounters. If you're going to want to engage in those long range duels, the AUG is definitely still the king. Let's see if we can get some of the other new guns. So most of the original chapter three guns are still there, like all of the regular shotguns, all of the SMGs, those are all still there. All of the items that were voted into the game last season, like balloons are all gone. The MK7 is vaulted. So pretty much Epic Games vaulted all the guns that were added as content last season. Okay, I think we have the DMR over here. This is the brand new sniper rifle slash AR. Let's go ahead and grab this bad boy. So the DMR is pretty much a semi-auto sniper rifle. It has bullet drop off, so you're going to shoot it like a sniper. And it doesn't do that much damage. I don't think it's that good. I don't think it's really worth using. Also, guys, animals are rideable now. But in order to ride them, you need the saddler, which is an item which places saddles onto the animals. So this thing is semi-auto, which means you're going to have to tap the trigger and you can't just hold it down. No, I'll drop the AUG. Why am I carrying that? Oh, I forgot. We also have the two-shot shotgun, which is pretty much the auto shotgun, but instead of one bullet, it shoots two at a time like this. This thing's pretty solid from what I've seen so far. Definitely going to have to test it out a little bit more. All right, so we got all three of the brand new guns here. We got the hammer assault rifle. We have the two-shot shotgun and we have the DMR. Let's keep on moving. Let's go ahead and get out of here. Uh, all the vehicles on the island are now summer themed, as in they have like a wrap on them that's kind of summer themed. Oh yeah, see this is what I was talking about, summer themed vehicle. Speaking of vehicles, ballers are back, except now they use fuel and they cannot be refueled. So once you run out of fuel on a baller, I'm assuming it's just going to break and you can't use it anymore. Okay, we gotta go kill this guy. Introduce him to our two-shot shotgun. Let's go find out how good this shotgun really is. I haven't been able to use it myself. First time using it. Oh, this guy's riding an animal. Yo. They're fighting. Also, your overshield now gets recharged once you get an elimination. It fully goes back to 50 once you get a kill. This guy has to be an NPC. There's just no way. I had to reload there. This thing takes ages to reload. That should not have been that close. That's kind of sad. All right, now we have all the loot here. We do have the resaddler as well, which means we can saddle onto animals and ride them. We can ride wolves and velociraptors. I think we could ride boars as well. I'm not sure. Okay, the saddle comes off of the animal apparently, or the animal must have died, honestly. Okay, the shotgun is pretty good. It's pretty powerful. I'm not sure if it's better than the auto shotgun or the striker pump, but it definitely can hold its own against them. We also got a brand new grappler item. It's very similar to the Spider-Man item, but I believe it's a little bit worse, and also it's not branded so i'm pretty sure epic games just added this item just so that they could add the spider-man gloves without being affiliated with marvel also i'm pretty sure you can kill clombos this season there is a clombo skull hidden on the map somewhere so i'm pretty sure that's foreshadowing that we can actually kill them back in chapter one epic games had a poi known as the block which would display featured creative builds from the community. And the block is returning this season. It's going to be called the block V2, and it's going to be displaying all sorts of featured creative community builds. In terms of game changes, that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and try to win this game now. Wait, shots up ahead. Yep, summer themed vehicles. I told you guys earlier. Looks pretty cool. Oh, there's a guy right here. Oh god, there's no, 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 no. Stand still and heal up, come on. Pop the medkit, come on. Get out of my lobby. Okay, hopefully this guy had some pretty good loot for us. Please tell me you had a saddler. A golden DMR. You know what? I'm gonna take it just for the content. Let's grab it. So far from what I've seen and my own experiences with it, the DMR doesn't seem to be too good, but I guess only time will tell how good this gun is. I forgot to mention earlier, the Ranger Assault Rifle is also still in the game, and that's also another option in case people don't like the Hammer Forged Rifle. Okay, this thing shoots pretty slow, but definitely gets the job done. Luckily, that guy's aim wasn't exactly the best. Otherwise, we would have been in a little bit of a sticky situation. Five people left. I'm hoping we can get a DMR kill. Probably not going to happen, though. This thing is pretty hard to use. All right, let's get out of here. What's the guy right here? Get ready to face the wrath of my DMR. I wonder how much headshot damage this thing does. It does 50 body shot, 55 body shot. Okay. Oh, 
Got some bot. Okay, wait. Stand still bot. 90 headshot damage. Okay, that's not too bad, honestly. For a semi-auto weapon, that's not terrible. Yeah, this guy's the AUG. Yep, I told you guys. The AUG is going to reign supreme from long-range duels. Okay, so this thing is accurate to exactly where the crosshair lands. So unlike snipers, you don't have to shoot a little bit higher or anything. You can shoot exactly where your target is. All right, the DMR is definitely a little bit weird to use. I was kind of beaming that guy earlier though. Oh. Get out of here. This is the guy from earlier, I'm pretty sure. We got the fully brand new season three loadout and two gamers left. Let's try to put an end to this game. Also, Darth Vader does have a mythic lightsaber that's going to be available soon. Do I just go for it or should I just play it out? I'll play it out. You know what? I mean, I risk this. I don't want to fumble the bag. We're just chilling. We're just chilling. Let's chill over here. And as soon as this guy makes a move, we're going to beam him with our hammer assault rifle. Oh, I see him. He sees me. 89 headshot is crazy. Wow. My guy has the worst cover down here. Oh my god, my aim is atrocious. Wow, how am I going to get down? I just realized, wow. But I can't, okay. Let's go over here. He can't get up, so I have the infinite high ground. And a supply drop. Let's go. Golden hammer assault rifle. All right, perfect. Let's go ahead and put this thing to use. He's hiding around this corner. As soon as he leaves that corner, it's over for him. Is that in zone? Barely. Okay, barely, barely. Wait, what? I can't see him. Oh, he's right there. Look at this, dude. I can't shoot at him, but I see him. Can I jump up here or no? Is that a no-go? Not even close. Okay. I think I should just go for it, honestly. Like, he doesn't have any cover over there. If I go behind the reboot van, it should be over for him. Let's do it. Let's go. GG's. First win of the season. Let's go ahead and check out the brand new umbrella. All right, here we have the Battle Bloom Umbrella. It looks pretty sick. It looks really cool. I think this is a replica of the huge tree and the reality tree is POI. Anyways, guys, that's it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed, make sure to drop a like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.